Let's have a look at how to prepare the ostomy adhesive before application to the skin. The hole in the adhesive must fit precisely to the shape of the stoma. If the hole is too big, the skin around the stoma is exposed to the effluent from the stoma and may be damaged. If the hole is too narrow, the adhesive cannot adhere to the surface of the stoma. A hole that is too narrow might also damage the stoma. For custom cutting the hole in the adhesive, you will need a stoma guide, a pen, and a pair of curved scissors. The diameter of the stoma will change over time, so make sure you always keep a close eye on the size of your stoma. To measure the diameter of your stoma, use the stoma guide. Try the different pre-cut holes in the stoma guide to find the hole size that best fits your stoma. If the hole is too big, the skin will not be protected properly. If the hole is too narrow, the adhesive will not adhere properly. The hole must fit precisely to the size of your stoma. If your stoma is oval, measure the different diameters of the stoma using the half circles of the stoma guide. Having measured the size of your stoma with the stoma guide, use the stoma guide to draw a cutting line matching these measurements on the back side of the adhesive. Pull away the bag a bit to ensure you don't damage the bag itself while cutting the hole. If your stoma is regular and you know the diameter of the stoma, just use the pre-printed cutting guide on the back side of the adhesive. If you don't know the diameter, use the stoma guide. Pull away the bag a bit to ensure you don't damage the bag itself while cutting the hole. To cut, use a pair of scissors, not too big, and preferably with a curved shape. When you remove the protective film, you can save it as a guide for the next time you prepare an adhesive.